Hi friends. Welcome back to the Lamely Garden. I'm Gleesey and today, y'all, I'm just sitting here enjoying my garden. My friend Cynthia said that it's important for us to take time out and just enjoy the garden and that's what I'm doing today. I'm in my, my little bench here. I made me a snowball and I'm watching. Oh, you can't see it because I can't flip the camera, but I'm watching YouTube. Um, and then I'm just kind of like peering around and looking at things and I am going to make a list of things that need to get taken care of here in the garden. Um, but I told myself that I would come out here for 45 minutes and I'm just going to sit, enjoy my snowball, drink some water and marvel in how this space has come to life. Like, look at this. Look at the garden, y'all. looking absolutely amazing um and i'm so grateful i'm so grateful for that reminder to kind of take a step back and reset so um y'all it's been a long time wouldn't have left you i think that's how that song go <laughs> okay so y'all i um i am a nurse and um this semester well, over the summer, I was asked to do a clinical session, which is fine. I normally would do a clinical session, but they had such an influx of students that they had more students than they did clinicals. So they asked me to pick up an extra clinical. And you know, I went from working three days a week to five days a week. And you might be like, oh, most people work five days a week. Well, I'm a nurse, so I work 12 hour shifts. So yes, you do the math. So it has been so hard to get out here in the garden, but I'm telling y'all, like before I go to work, <laughs> and after I go to work, or after I come home from work, like the garden, the garden is one of my first stops because not only is this my place to grow food and have some self-sufficiency, but it's also like my place to unwind and relax. So. I can't not come out here. Like, I don't care how tired I be. Like, I'm gonna come out to this garden and check on it. I'm looking at this mosquito, y'all. He tried me. The nets and the mosquitoes are so bad right now. Like, I don't know what's going on. But, um, I wanna show y'all something real quick. Can y'all see this right here? Y'all see that? Can you see it? Y'all, those would be flowers. And I'm pretty sure if this is like any other thing that I've grown, flowers come before the fruit. So y'all, we might get some lemons. So we might get some lemons. I got real excited when I came out here and I would not have seen them probably if I didn't just come out here and relax. Cause I'm sitting, like I'm, I'm just sitting and looking and marveling at all I've been able to do <clears throat> over the past few months. So it is July second. Can y'all believe it? It's July, but here in Maryland Zone Seven, like we're really, really getting started with the summer crops. Like I think two weeks ago, I just planted some watermelon. So it's not too late to put some seeds in the ground, y'all not too late to get started just just go for it go for it um check the dates on your um like how long it takes stuff to grow like i'm gonna plant some green beans um some more green beans i know um but yes i'm gonna plant some more green beans and this particular variety it's like a 60 day variety so june 1st i mean july 2nd meaning august september 2nd we should be getting green beans and the weather should be cooling down around that time, but you just never know how things will be in Maryland. So um, I have these green beans here. They're looking real light green, right? They real light. But these green beans right here are coming to the end of their prime. So what I'll probably do is pull them plants out and then plant my light green ones, fertilize it in, you know, because these should start to flower pretty soon. So 
um i have some other green beans on the other side down there that have already I, like i've already succession plants so that's why i'm saying like i plan on starting more green beans today that way i can continuously have green beans because um that was one of the big things that my son asked me to grow all right i just wanted to pass on that reminder that was given to me that sometimes we just have to take a step back and enjoy the garden and just remember all you got to do is put some seeds in the ground bye guys